What a WWE SmackDown Live that was last night, guys. And today, this is going to be Matt's WWE SmackDown Live review from last night's show. So here we go. We kick off WWE SmackDown Live with Here Comes the Money, Shame It Man. He comes out and then he starts to... He starts to bring down the the mystery briefcase in all color it was. It was white, and the next he started to tell them the rules of what they have to do. And then James Elwer starts to say, Duh, shame it, man, we already do know what, what, what they all have to do, and stuff like that. And then all the rest of the women start talking to each other about who's going to win the briefcase at Dirty Money in the Bank pay-per-view. And then, of course... Feel the glow. Naomi comes out and then she starts talking to everybody and stuff like that about the cashing in and stuff. And then, of course, you know, also made her debut on SmackDown Live. Lena in a blue dress. She starts to come out and tell Shane Man that she wants to wrestle in this match since Naomi can't be in it. And then. She was upset because everybody were like laughing at her and stuff like that because of the wrestling and stuff like that. And then Shane McMahon said, well, you have to earn a title opportunity to Lena. And then she was mad, so she went to the back. And then you know what? Then Shane McMahon made a six-woman tag team match. And we got match number one on the night. And it is the six woman match and it is hold on and it is Natalia, Tamina, Carmella, and the money the bank competitors with Naomi and this match was pretty good. I really enjoyed it. And then Lena comes out and she makes her team lose Charlotte Flair, Naomi and Becky Lynch by pulling Lena pull Naomi's leg and then Tamina went for the super kick, and then that was it for the one, two, three. Here's your winner, Natalia, Tamina, and Carmella. And that was it, guys. So now we have match number two of the night. AJ Styles versus the show-off, Dolph Ziggler. That match was pretty good. I really enjoyed it. Dolph Ziggler lost. He, he AJ Styles beat him with uh, his finisher, and he did the Styles clash on him for the one, two, three, and that was it. And it was a good match. And now we have match number three of the night: Ginger Mahal versus Mojo Rawley. And remember this: what Shane McMahon said to Mojo Rawley, if he won his match. He was going to be in the money bank, but he lost. But then before the match started, the Sin Brother was talking on the microphone by introducing the WWE Champion, Ninja Mahal. And then, of course, Ninja Mahal won with his finisher, and he pinned Mojo Rawley, and that was it for the one, two, three, and that match was pretty good. And, of course, Ginger Mahal does go on the microphone. Then he starts to talk about Randy Orton. And then he starts to say that he is sick and stuff like that. And that he is a Mojani and stuff like that. And that he says he will beat Randy Orton at W Money in the Bank. And stuff like that. And then that was it. And now we have match number four of the night. And it is the New Day. Two. Day rocks. Two. Day Rocks versus The Kalan, Primo and Epico. And this match was pretty good. I really enjoyed it. And plus, the New Day won. They pinned one of the Kalans, and it was good. And then right after the match, um, the Uzos come out, and then they start talking on the microphone, and they were making fun of the New Day and stuff like that. And the New Day did not like it one bit and stuff like that. So then that was it. And now we have the main event of the night. Sensuke Nakamura. Whoa! Oh, 
versus the U.S. champion Kevin Owens. That match was pretty good. I really enjoyed it. Since he knocked him on one, he did his finisher. He kicked Kevin Owens in the face for his finisher. And then that was it for the one, two, three. And then guess what? It'll happen after the end of the match. Born Corbin comes out and then he does the end of days to Sensei Nakamura and then he goes on top of the stage doing this and that was it for WWE Smackdown Live and what a WWE Smackdown Live that was last night guys so guys once again I hope you all enjoy Matt's WWE Smackdown Live review from last night's show so guys once again please like this video Leave a comment and subscribe. Peace out, guys. See ya.